My prince, look over there! Would you look at that? I guess we've arrived. Whoa, it looks way older than the palace. Yes, it seems untouched by the ravages of time. That's it. Looks like a core crystal. Is that the Omega Feta? Yes. That's Ophian's control core. It was originally a conduit that I used to communicate with Ophion. We have to hurry. Yes, you're right. Hmm. Well, can you fix it? Shut up. I'm sorry. <sighs> Mithra? Whoa. In that case... Are we... rising? All right, Prince. I've told Genbu to resume circling the Cloud Sea once he's done rising. Nice. Looks like we made it, after all. Oh, great news! Oh, Tora was not look forward to becoming flat as Argenta Monkfish. A job well done, eh? Hey, Rex, you can remove that thing now. Hmm. So it was hidden all the way out here. What? No wonder we couldn't find it. I'd just been wondering whether it was time to make an exit. Thanks for saving me the trouble. Lovely to see that tedious woman isn't here to get in our way this time. Care to join me? In a dance of death, Nia? I think I just threw up in my mouth a bit. Mean little girl. You've come for the feta, haven't you? Perceptive, kid. Condescending much? It's not like there's anything else here. You are so mean. Now, hand it over nicely would be the classic line, but no. I'm not letting you escape with your lives. For Jin's sake. Where are Jin and Malos anyway? There are a few things I need to ask them. Frankly, I don't think they've got much interest in what you have to say. Sure about that? Quite sure, yes. Not to interrupt the verbal spark, but how do you plan on doing anything without your blades? We're no pushovers, you know. Oh, we're quite aware of that. We just don't need them. You see? Explain yourself. Talk 
crystals. They're blades. Worse, flesh eaters. Bravo. Very good. We've had many an interruption in the past, but here that seems less likely. So let's go all out. You can try, but I assure you, we won't go down easy. I wouldn't have it any other way. Like I said, all. Oh.